Lanier. This is Rochelle and yet another episode of Let Me Tell You Something. No, it's not really called that. It's called Smart, Smart, Stupid. But um, they tell me this is episode 12. I'm going to take them at their word. Okay, so back in 2015, Norwegian Cruise Lines, you're welcome, Royal Caribbean. You're getting a break this episode. Norwegian Cruise Lines was really kind of sick of what I call little piggy behavior. This is when people take their dishes and they stack them up in the hallway. Now, I know you're thinking, what am I supposed to do with them? You know what? Not my problem. Because when I'm coming back to my room in these heels, look at it in facial compare. It's the size of my face, these heels. When I'm going down those narrow little cruise ship hallways, I don't want to be stepping over your unfinished dish of fries and cottage cheese and mussels with your coffee cups and the Dr. Seuss stacks of dishes. It's disgusting, okay? Really, did your mother raise you like you lived in a pigsty? Oh my God. So like it was literally a higher up in one of the Norwegian cruise ships was going on board a ship and was walking down the hall and he saw this disgusting display of human behavior and he said, we have got to stop this. But he probably said it in a Norwegian accent, which I can't do. It would probably just sound Swedish and insulting, so I'm not going to try. So they put the kibosh on this behavior and Lord love them, they literally set up gods at the buffet. So when people would go to the buffet and they'd fill up their plate with whatever the hell they felt they needed to eat in their bed that night, someone at the buffet exit had to stop them and either tell them to sit down and eat it there or to leave it and walk away. No more taking the food out. You cannot imagine how the little piggies reacted. They blew their stack. They went to the internet and complained. They did the Facebook thing. They wrote letters to the companies. And by wrote letters, I mean emailed a lot. They tweeted about it back when Twitter was Twitter and not X, which is kind of stupid. But at any rate, they made such a big freaking deal about it that Norwegian was really close to doing something and they didn't. And then one tweeter said, I bet they're doing this so that they don't, they, they make us pay that $8 room service charge fee that they charge. And Norwegian caved. What? freaking idiots. They admitted that was part of the reason. Not the ugly dishes in the hallways that attracted bugs, but that they were losing the $8 service charge fee. And so what did they do? Once the internet said, aha, we got you, they had to fess up and they allowed it again. So now when you're on Norwegian cruise ships and you're going down the halls and you're sidestepping uneaten French fries and mashed potatoes, you have the little piggies to think because they didn't want to pay eight bucks. So I suggest very strongly that you click on the link below and you buy me a cup of coffee, which I will not leave the empty cup out in the hallway because I am not one of the little piggies. And while you're at it, I want you to go ahead and find someone in your office you don't like and take their phone and subscribe them to this podcast. And then they'll be like, what the hell? And they'll watch it. That's it. That's the end of the plan. I, I don't got anything else, but I think it's a good idea. Subscribe and buy me coffee. Bye.